Stan Jibalisco here again. W1GV is my call sign, Whiskey One Golf Victor. I'd like to take another little tour of some of the higher frequency HF radio bands. In this particular case, I'm going to focus on the 18 megahertz band. It goes from 18.068 to 18.168 megahertz. Our time here is 2353 Zulu on August 1st, 2013. That would be 5 minutes to 6 Mountain Daylight Time. Last night I <clears throat> yeah, inadvertently said Mountain Standard Time. Well, no, we use daylight time here in the Black Hills of Dakota Territory. I've got this radio uh, tuned to the maximum sensitivity that it possibly can have. A pre-amplifier, you can see that right down here. Uh, I believe I can point to it right there. Two, that's the highest level of amplification uh, that the pre-amplifier has to offer. That's partly why you see so much noise on the S-meter, almost S5. This is also a rather noisy <clears throat> location. There's a signal. Now apparently there's a DX station on there somewhere. Just above the lower band limit. So somebody's actually taking advantage of this band. Let's keep going up and up and up. There's no one. Some very faint signals. Well, maybe one. Let's keep going. Keep going. Now, this uh, band, um, one might get the impression that it's pretty close to dead. Let's keep going up and up and up. No CW signals. Now, you might hear, you might expect to hear some if the band is open. But then again, maybe not. Maybe just everybody assumes that it's not open. Let's keep going, keep going. Keep going, keep going. Now up here, big signal. That is W1AW in Newington, Connecticut. Notice S9. Last night it was close to 15 or even 20 dB over S9. It's about as strong as a signal ever gets. So the band is open between Dakota Territory and New England right now. Obviously. What's this? Somebody's using um, MFSK multiple frequency shift keying. That is one of the modes that fascinates me. That really fascinates me. I, I, I just uh, think that some of these new digital modes are the coolest thing since Big Island Bakery sourdough rye bread. Well, that's maybe a topic for a whole nother video. When I lived in the Big Island of Hawaii, one of my favorite things was Big Island Bakery sourdough rye bread. If you ever go there, to Kona or Hilo, check it out. Nobody, nobody. We're going up the band, nobody. W1AW's on there, somebody's using MFSK, and there's a somebody working some DX. What's this? Now, nah. keep going, keep going. Now, here's a signal, I think, isn't it? Southern accent must be coming down there from southeastern U.S. Well, here's another one. 
Yeah, there, there are some people using the ban tonight. Maybe they listened to what I said last night. They've all been watching my videos. Don't I wish. Let's keep going, keep going, keep going. Now, you'd think that there'd be a lot more people using this band. It's one of the more interesting bands in terms of its propagation potential. Now, W1AW's propagation bulletin last night was focusing on how uh, unspectacular this sunspot cycle peak has been. Well, if you keep telling everybody it... So, well, another signal. Somebody on SSB. I wish more people would use um, CW and Plenty of people using those digital modes, though. PSK31, I like that mode. That's the top of the band right there. So once again, we can go back down. Back down. You can hear a few. Can Just a very few. W1AW, just finishing up its um, code practice session and about ready to launch its bulletin. I, I worked there in 1977-1978 as one of the uh, operators of that station. And their schedule today is just about the same as it was then. Uh, they, they've got a f not so many weekend hours as they had then. Let's go down to 14 megahertz. Now we'll put her on the SSB filter again check out this band. Let's start at the bottom. There's some signals on this band. Of course, you'd expect it to be more likely to be open than 18 megahertz, but we're going, we're going, we're going. A pretty good signal. There's W1AW again. Good, strong signal. Notice I only have the preamplifier on this band set to one. Uh, there are three settings, off, one, and two. Now we go up. Now those are all the phase shift keyed signals at 14.070 uh, roughly and the three kilohertz up from there. Lots of, lots of activity typically there. Let's take a look at 21 megahertz. Anybody there? Notice the preamplifier is once again at 2. I don't hear much. I think those are just birdies. Sounds like another birdie. Maybe computer. There! There's somebody! weak, but there he is, or she. Let's keep going. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Now, there's W1AW. Not that strong on this band, although last night, a little later, it was up around 10 dB over S9. Well, the moral to this story Well, that's strange. I've never heard a signal like that. There are some people using it. Hey, you've been listening to me. Keep sending those CQs out on these bands, folks. We don't want to neglect these bands while we've got them, because when the sunspots start to go down, these bands really will be dead. Anyway, from the Black Hills of South Dakota, I have yammered enough. W1GV Whiskey 1 Golf Victor signing off for now 73 and look for me occasionally on the 20 meter band using Morse code or PSK 31 so long <laughs>